as we have seen in our previous session like uh, we have different uh, phases in our rpa life cycle the first uh, phase is software installation so once you log into rpa manager what you can see is on to my right side there is something like download applications so this is the software installation phase you have to download rpa recorder then download rpa builder and download rba bot so these are the three software tools that are required to in, uh, download and install that is the software installation phase so we will be good with software installation phase once we install all these three so one is rpa recorder rpa builder and rpa bot all right so once it is done what is our next phase our next phase is access and user management just like we have access management in any point platform you can go to user management here okay click on users and uh, if you are admin of your rpa account you can create new user you can invite other users all right and uh, you can assign roles just like how we have like in any point platform like assigning roles for exchange runtime manager etc here also you have roles for them as i am not the admin for this particular account so i won't be having this uh, facility so you can always create your api keys this is required when you are trying to connect your application in rpa builder or rpa recorder okay so whenever you i will show you that in our coming sessions but uh, if you want to create a api key you can always click on create new key and you can um, uh, try to connect our uh, just like you know imagine like in any point studio we are logging through exchange with our credentials in the same way for rpa builder when we are developing our uh, rpa processes or you know when we are de developing our bots it is necessary for us to connect to rpa manager so how are we connecting to rpa manager we will be using the url here like this and then username password and the token so when you click on new api key you will get that token i will show you that as well in the coming sessions but before that our next phase is evaluate phase that will be covered in our next session but till here for now we have con uh, we have completed two phases one is uh, software installation and the access user management phases so see you in the next session